Okay, in this example, we're going to look at how to find the determinant of a 2x2 two two matrix. So here I have matrix A, which is this 2x2 two two matrix with entries A, B, C, and D. I'm doing this in the abstract to give you the formula. The determinant of matrix A is actually equal to A times D. If you look, those are the entries on this diagonal, A times D, minus the product of B times C, the entries on that other diagonal. So let's look at an example now of how to apply this. Let's say I have matrix A is actually equal to 1, 3, negative 2, 5, for instance, like that. And I want to find the determinant of matrix A. Well, according to this formula, that would be equal to 1 times 5. I'll go ahead and write that out. 1 times 5, it's the product of that diagonal, minus 3 times negative 2. So in this case, 1 times 5 is 5, and then minus 3 times negative 2 is negative 6, minus negative 6 in this instance actually would turn into plus 6, which would give you 11 there. So the determinant of this is actually equal to 11. I'm going to go ahead and show another notation here really quick as well, since I just have this equals 11 here. If you see these vertical bars, 1, 3, negative 2, and 5, like that around a rectangular arrangement of numbers, uh, that is asking you to find the determinant of that matrix. That's another way to indicate that they want you to find the determinant of this instead of saying like determinant of A, like that. So if you see it in the vertical bars, they're asking you what's the determinant. Like that. And again, it's just the product of A times D minus the product of B times C. Be careful you don't make sign mistakes and simplify that, and it's pretty easy from there.